Hey guys, Angus here from angusPT.com. Uh, please like and subscribe and all that. Not going to take up too much of your time. No intro. Review on the Lumen sort of metabolic hacking device. It's basically a breath analyzer that picks up CO2 in your breath to see whether you're burning more fat or more carbohydrates and then it gives you kind of nutritional recommendations based on that. And as far as that, it does that. It's pretty freaking awesome. I'm a personal trainer and I'm always on the lookout for things that can either help me in my job or I'm very well aware that personal trainers are kind of the carriage makers of this industry. And when cars came along, carriage makers kind of came out of a job. And technology is moving at such a rate that we've got to be cognizant of these sort of devices coming in. So it comes in this little pouchy. The device itself, really well made, really nice metal cap on it, take it off, it's magnetically clicks onto there. You do a breath test, it was meant to be one breath but it's actually two to three breaths. You take a massive inhale uh, with it, hold it for 10 seconds and you breathe out and then it detects how much CO2 you have and then based on that it gives you a reading of one, two, three, four or five. Five being the highest, you're burning mostly carbs and one being the lowest, you're burning mostly fat. And as far as that, it seems to do that really accurately. The problem with the last two weeks is when I received it, I wasn't really following its nutritional advice. It was kind of sorting out my workouts and sorting out that. So I was using it every single day, maybe three to four times a day. Um, and then I would have to tell Lumen that I didn't follow its nutritional advice and it would kind of make uh, things. So for the next little while, I'm gonna follow this 100% and see how I get on. But so far, because I've been getting so many questions on it, so far people want to know, do I like it, do I like it? Um, and I really like it, I think it's really cool, I think it's really interesting. It is like a nutritionist in your pocket. It's not gonna give you your micronutrients, but it is gonna give you your macronutrients, your protein, fats, and carbs. And as far as I can see, the recommendations are, are pretty good and they're spot on. Not only are they spot on, they're better than what I think a nutrition coach could really do because it's based on how you're operating that day. Um, but you're gonna have to use a little bit of common sense. So say you've got a marathon and it doesn't, it, you can log in that you're going for a run and you got this and it will give you kind of carb recommendations on that. I think there's a bit of tweaking still to be had there. The app is really nice, but you're gonna have to log calories in a separate app to answer the questions the next day of how many carb portions you have. Um, so I think if this is just, you, you just want to use this without doing any work, you're gonna be, you're gonna be kind of, it's not gonna be for you. It's not, it's not doing the work for you. You're gonna, it's, it's, it's just a coach that's saying, hey, eat this and you, you're gonna be good. But you have to eat that. You can't just go get McDonald's. You can't just go do whatever you want. So it's a nutrition coach if you're serious. Um, I think if you're looking for a gimmick and a hack and, and some way, um, but you just want to eat whatever you want and you're not going to make any changes, it's not for you. If you're an athlete, I think this could be really interesting for you. Maybe fell there. Um, I think if you're an athlete, it could be really interesting for you. I think that its recommendations are, are pretty good. When I first logged in, it told me that um, recommended, there's three settings. You can have kind of a maintenance settings, a performance setting, and a fat loss session. It told me to go on the fat loss session, which was like um, fat shaming uh, 101, hashtag fat shaming. But um, I've changed that to performance and it's given you me, of course, more calories with that. I think, I think if you're using, wanting to use it as a fat loss device, I think it could be really useful because I think the biggest mistake people make with fat loss is they just go on a calorie deficit and drive down those hormones they go on a calorie deficit and they just drive those hormones right down to the ground um, and this will kind of give you higher carb days to boost your hormones and that's one of the biggest key things in having a refeed day that people are missing with a calorie and that's why a lot of people are, are failing because you want to kind of reset and rebalance these hormones and it's not just a straight deficit forever. You kind of go up and down, up and down, you kind of ride the wave and Lumen could really help with that. So as far as that goes, we're approaching the kind of five minute mark I like it, I recommend it. I'm gonna do another video when I follow it 100% to give my kind of final critique on it. But because so many people have been asking, I like it, it works well, it does what it should. Taking the breaths can be pretty tricky. Um, you do need to charge it most nights, I would say. 
Um, taking the breath is, can be tricky, and about one out of every 10, I just mess up the breath. Either I'm bloated or I just can't take a deep enough breath, or I just can't hold the breath, or someone's talking to me, you need a bit of quiet space to do it. Um, I'm loving it so far, and I'm looking forward to kind of doing mini experiments with it to see what it can do. I think it's really useful, I think it's really interesting, I think it's really unique, and yeah, I like it, thumbs up.